In this uh, tutorial, we'll look at how you can use uh, important sampling analysis to um, solve our reliability problem. And we're going to study the same problem as, the, as we did in the last couple of uh, tutorials. So the function is listed here in the uh, properties pane when I've selected it in the objects pane. And I now um, go to the um, analysis methods where again I'm going to make use of, of sampling analysis. So that's the same orchestrating um, algorithm. And in fact, it's also going to be the failure probability accumulator that I want to use because I want to study the failure probability and reliability index. But here's an important point that we will uh, make in this tutorial. And uh, we make the point by looking at the random number generator. The uh, sample point or the center of the sampling distribution uh, is the current value, it says here, of the random variables. So this time I'm going to first run a form analysis uh, thereby setting the current value of the random variables to the design point coordinates uh, and then I'm going to carry out um, sampling analysis uh, using the current value of the random variables as the sampling center. So uh, for that reason I first go to um, analysis, run analysis and I run a form analysis. We have done it before in a tutorial and now I go to um, in fact, I'm going to check the sampling analysis orchestrating algorithm. Yeah, uh, we have the failure probability accumulator uh, as we wanted. And again, double checking that the current value of the random variables is set as the uh, sampling center. And now we carry out an analysis with the failure probability accumulator, namely that way of uh, processing the sampling points as the sampling analysis goes on. So here I go to run analysis. Uh, I carry the I, I select the um, sampling analysis orchestrating algorithm and I press OK and this went very quick here the uh, plot that appears now from the sampling analysis is the same thing as um, we had in the Monte Carlo sampling uh, where the coefficient of variation of the sampling result of that failure probability result uh, is plotted as a function of the number of samples and now you can see that uh, quite few samples, in fact 999 samples were, were necessary, which is far fewer sampling samples than what was necessary from um, mean-centered Monte Carlo analysis, now that we carried out important sampling around the design point. Again, the failure probability is uh, a little over 1.8. So that was important sampling in art.